Here we are again, uh, taking a break from Brexit. Hey. We've had a question from a viewer who's asked, why do you actually do these films? The first reason we do these films is I'm deeply insecure uh, and shy. He said, looking straight into the camera. And sometimes you just need to get some cameras on yourself and crank your ego up. Uh, so that's one of the reasons we do these. And it, it, it realistically also gives us vent for our creative spleen as a company. But the other reason we do it is to keep people posted on what we do and on current events and how it might affect them, their aspirations and their objectives. When it really comes down to it, while we deal in financial services, we deal in money, uh, the, the bot and the bottom line is that uh, money is the thing that facilitates everything you want to do. What we actually are in the business of doing is delivering on people's aspirations, objectives and helping them reach their dreams, which is what they need their money to do. Basically, we're in the business of trust. As our clients come to see us, they tell us what they want to achieve and we're going to show them a way to get there. Now there are occasions, like Brexit for example, where we're deviating from the, the, sort of the, uh, the, the stream of warmth and permanence and the, the trajectory we would otherwise expect for the money. And at that point, people be naturally become anxious. And so it's important that we then explain what's going on in a way that they can understand and how it's affected them. And that's the principal reason for these films, is to underpin the trust that we have with our clients through helping them to understand more effectively what's going on and to empower making informed choices. Anyway, so now you know why we're making these films uh, and there's a whole cache of these on, on YouTube if you want to go back and have a look at them. Uh, if you've got any questions that you'd like to ask me, then just email those across and we'll deal with these in these films. Uh, but otherwise, with the, the incipient uh, departure of the UK from the EU and all the issues that might create and anxieties that might go with it, then we'll have more of this and keep you informed next time. Because I'm actually very shy. No, really, I, I'm. Sh no, I am very, very shy. And the, the whole point of this is, it's, it's, is you know, I'm very insecure and shy.